Hello, beautiful people. Welcome back to another tantalizing episode of YouTuber Tributes. I'm your host, The Dirty Rancher, and with me, as always, is Rexy. And today, we're going to be taking a deep dive into... into... Wait, why does this keep happening? I just don't get it. These aren't my intros. Does it mean something? Or is it just a bit? Well, we'll find out in the future, folks. But until then, let's get on with the video. You get yourself a pretty channel there. <laughs> Why don't you squeal like a YouTuber? <laughs> Leon started uploading on YouTube about 13 years ago, making song covers. He did these covers for about three years before going on a short hiatus. When he started uploading again almost two years later, he changed up his content style. The production and editing quality had increased tenfold. He clearly practiced making this content, really quality content before starting up again. And Leon began focusing more on influencer, social media, and toxic culture based content, slowly perfecting his own brand and style of delivering entertainment. And this is what we know Leon for today. He briefly dabbled in how-to videos before refining his art form in commentary, the witty, funny, logical commentary he is well known for. And with this new genre of content Leon started creating, his logic and intellect shined through as a result. And this subject I will be touching up upon shortly. But Leon's origins were as humble and wholesome as he is now, as I imagined he has always been. And it shocks me that he wasn't noticed earlier on the YouTube platform, but let's be honest, it can be a tough gig making it as a YouTuber. You have to grind and grind on the platform until you get noticed, yet his subtle and impactful rise to popularity wasn't just noticeable to me, but it was inspirational. To see and witness someone uh, applying such logical use to an online personality truly is humbling, and Leon clearly isn't a toxic creator. He uses satire to combat that toxicity online he faces, and that, to me, folks, is an A-plus creator in my books. His logical use of internet personality, as previously stated, is truly humbling. And Leon, like lots of us, try to use simple common sense when making and uploading content. I'm sure that before he started up again, that Leon knew you know, putting yourself out there on the internet leaves you open as a target for some idiots and toxic people that border the subhuman behavior you'd expect from a brain-dead career criminal. But Leon seems to have easily strategized a solid format and attitude to project to his audience wisely. He fully understands his limits to what he can reveal about his life, and with that, if he is targeted online, Leon definitely knows exactly how to react and reply. Calmly! with devastating blows and comebacks, wisely and discreetly executed. This, ladies and gentlemen, is what I call logical use of internet personality. Now, let me recap on the subject of Leon's intelligence and his personality. Leon has previously stated in videos past about being homeschooled most of his youth, only attending 11th and 12th grade later on, after asking his parents to experience a public school setting for a short period of time. He did football while attending high school and then proceeded to go to college afterwards. In my experience with public schools, I've come to understand the lack of motivation, dedication and sheer attention span of most students. And it comes to, it seems to me it stems from an increase in student numbers, a decrease in trained, well-paid staff, and many other underlining issues that manifest in public schools, like bullying, but let's not get into that right now. 
In a homeschooled environment, the student or students can be focused on in a more refined setting, assuring the full retainment of useful, incredible knowledge. And within these surroundings, Leon had obviously flourished, not only gaining knowledge, but a great moral compass and charismatic personality. While watching his videos, I often find myself improving on my vocabulary, thanks to Leon's intelligence. He truly does seem like a genuine down-to-earth kind of guy, and he loves metal music too, and what's not to enjoy about that? Come on, come on now. Leon does co-host a secondary channel with his wife, Mrs. Lush, called Lush Life. This is a deeper dive into his commentary style and into his personal life. Usually reacting to otherwise controversial, provocative, popular, or hilarious content from other platforms like TikTok and Vine. It's a more wholesome version of Leon's main channel, a look into his love-filled life. He's definitely a family man. Seems like a great husband and a fantastic dad. He truly has it all, folks. And what I mean by that is what most of us strive for. A healthy, happy family, a good sense of humor, and a sound, logical mind. So I definitely recommend subscribing to Lush Life. And Leon also occasionally streams on Twitch. Streaming entertaining playthroughs of games like Call of Duty Warzone. A lovely watch for the average Twitch enjoyer. Yes, Leon is a man of talent, a cool cat, a suave gentleman. He has a sunny disposition on life, which is a great way to combat society's ills and toxicity online. He is someone I, uh, I personally learn from, and I'm sure you can learn from too. You can laugh with him, and you can root for him. You know, that's the kind of guy he is. You can learn from him, laugh with him, and root for him. To check out and or sub to his channels Leon Lush, Lush Life, or his Twitch channel under the same name Leon Lush, won't leave you disappointed, I promise you. His contents, opinions, and logical debates have helped me wisen up in many ways. I find that I'm more mindful after viewing one of Leon's videos. And that's not really a bad thing at all, is it, folks? So please, if for some reason you've not heard of Leon or his content, go show the man some love and give his channels a try. It will most certainly be a good decision for you, I swear to it. So with that all said, thank you very much, folks, for watching. I truly very much appreciate it. I hope you take care out there and have a fantastic day. <laughs> Sorry, you go for it because it was a long one when it sucked. Hello and welcome. Oh my god, no, I'm sorry. No, what's wrong with that? That's okay. Hello, beautiful people, and welcome back to another episode. Another ten. Oh my god. Let's do that again. <laughs> You can add it in the blooper, see? Maybe. Maybe I don't know if I'm going to have bloopers this time. Well, hey there. Dirty Rancher here. I just want to say thanks for watching the video. It really makes my day to see those views go up. So remember, like, subscribe, share, and comment. Have a great day.